I had this experience, I was painting, and an assistant professor walked in to the studio unannounced. He looked at the painting I was working on, and he said, that surface is so beautiful, it's terrifying, and walked out. <laughs> My reaction to that statement was to destroy the painting. I didn't know if I could accept beauty as a way um, toward what, what I was trying to create. And as I walked home and as I thought about this, why did I do that? You know, I realized there was this gap in my heart, maybe where my intuition and um, my creativity had reached, but I didn't have a framework for it. I didn't have an operating system <laughs> that could deal with this complexity of beauty that is terrifying. And it wasn't until I truly understood the gospel that that is precisely what happened at, at the cross. Beauty had to be destroyed so I could create. That made sense to me.